There are about 7 million registered voters in Georgia. The Democratic candidates will be trying to impress them all and millions more around the country as they take the stage at Tyler Perry Studios tomorrow evening. Georgia will be a crucial state to win in 2020. A new exclusive 11 Alive poll reinforcing that. In the poll just released, more Georgia voters support Joe Biden went up against other Democratic candidates and President Trump. Now, if those numbers do indeed hold up, it would be significant in a state that supported President Trump by five points in 2016. Bill Clinton was the last Democratic presidential candidate to win Georgia, and that was in 1992. And we have team coverage tonight with John Sherrick. He is inside the debate hall at Tyler Perry Studios. But we begin with Doug Richards, who has the exclusive poll results. Doug? Well, Jeff and Cheryl, the headline of the poll shows Democratic primary voters in Georgia like Joe Biden. And if Biden were the nominee, he could beat President Trump in Georgia in the November election. Here's what Democratic voters told us. 39% of them support former Vice President Biden. He got more thumbs ups from voters than Senators Bernie Sanders and Elizabeth Warren combined. The third tier is anchored by Indiana's Pete Buttigieg, who stumped in Atlanta last night, and Kamala Harris of California. The rest of the field combined had fewer votes than Harris and Buttigieg. Significantly, 10 percent say they still haven't made a choice. By and large, especially our, our seasoned African-American voters are solidly behind Joe Biden. Atlanta Mayor Keisha Lance Bottoms was an early backer of Joe Biden and says our poll doesn't surprise her. I think they want a voice of reason and a voice of wisdom. And I think that aligns with who Joe Biden is. Now let's go to the general election. It's all but certain Donald Trump will be the Republican nominee. Our poll shows Biden edging President Trump in the November election in Georgia, though statistically it's a deadlock because the four point difference is within the margin of error. Same thing with Bernie Sanders, who outpolled Trump but is statistically deadlocked. Warren is likewise deadlocked with the president. Our poll shows slightly weaker support for Buttigieg and Harris when facing Trump head to head in Georgia. And Mayor Bottoms was right. Our poll shows that African American voters in Georgia were most excited about Biden and Bernie Sanders more so than they were about Kamala Harris, who is uh, obviously a candidate of color. The field will undoubtedly narrow by the time Georgia Democrats actually vote in the March 24th primary. You can read more of our poll results on 11alivenews.com or the 11alive news app, Jeff. Long way to go before late March. Doug, thank you.